live from Bahrain, the Khalifa Sports City, welcome to Brave Combat Federation number nine, the Kingdom of Champions. In the middleweight division, Russia's Ikram Alaskarov takes on South Africa's pit bull, Jeremy Smith. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are at our fifth bout of the evening. This is three five-minute rounds in the middleweight division. Introducing our first warrior, fighting out of the blue corner. This man's a mixed martial artist with a professional record of nine wins and four losses. He stands. 177.8 centimeters tall and weighs already 83.7 kilograms. Playing out of Johannesburg, South Africa, representing Guerrilla Warfare Gym. Give it up for Jeremy the Pitbull Smith. And his opponent. Fighting out of the red corner, this man is a mixed martial artist with a professional record of four wins and no losses. He stands 183 centimeters tall and weighs already 83.6 kilograms. Fighting out of Russia and representing champion and KHK MMA, give it up for Ingram Alistair. Your referee is Scott Manhart. And here we go, big time middleweight action here. Ikram Eliskarov taking on Jeremy Smith. This is a big one, gentlemen. Both guys have serious power. Eliskarov, of course, Dagestani. This guy has serious wrestling ability. I think that they were born with that, correct? They're born warriors. I train with a lot of Dagestani fighters, and they're, uh, they're some of the toughest that, that, that are alive on this planet. In the red with the black <laughs> trim, that is so Aliskarov, a guy that is an absolute prospect. Everybody's talking about, but don't discount the pit bull. Jeremy Smith, the guy that was champion down in South Africa, an absolute beast. He, he's not afraid to throw heat. He sits down on that pretty much every one of his punches. Also a champion internationally as well with another promotion. So, you know, the pit bull's been around for a while. He took, had about a two year break. Um, but came back here really hungry, fought Marcos Parada down in Brazil. We remember that war. Break. That was a, that was a bananas fight. These guys went slinging. I mean, nice solid jab by <laughs> Well, you can see the blood coming down the nose there, right above the nose of Jeremy Smith. They opened him up. Uh, there we go. That was a punch to the eye. That's a huge hit there from the, from the Dagestani. Yeah, the blood getting into the eye, the right eye of Jeremy Smith, and it's definitely bothering him. Ikram's got his timing down. He does. He's, he's timing that shot. Looks like he's still rubbing up and rubbing his eye. Had some issues there. Yeah, it's definitely bothering that him. That jab is finding its home. Well, it was already finding its home, and now he has the blood in his eye. Now it's even worse. Head kick caught him coming in. Oh, yeah, he ate a little bit of that knee. Man, Jeremy, man, he's a tough, tough dude. Absolutely, you know, I, you guys, I spent a lot of time down in South Africa, so I get to know these guys very, very well. And Jeremy Smith's one of those guys, an absolute warrior, one of the best to go through the organizations down in South Africa, and now makes the move over to Brave Combat Federation. Ooh, good knee. Good shot. Just missed that with that, that left knee. So it looks like, oh, Ikram's just is waiting for that. There it is, that oh, huge over right. Scott stops the fight. And Manhart says it's over. He, oh, did, he went down. I'll be honest, he went down. Um, might have been a little early, but I think that that was the beginning. And he was taking some damage in there yeah. pretty early on. You want to give the guy the fight a chance, but uh, I mean, sometimes you're saving for themselves. It's tough. That's a tough call, but you know what? You know, one of, one of our best referees, Scott Manhart. And Aliskarov, he definitely landed that one flush. Big right hand. Disappointing loss here. Uh, for Jeremy Smith, of course, he's protesting it, not happy about it, um, which is normal. I mean, obviously, yeah, but at the, fighter. At the same fight. time, in my opinion, it looked like he was trying to pop back up. I don't know. You're, you're, 
What do you think, Sutter? I, I mean, I'd be furious if I was him, yeah, man. I, I would want to go out on my shield, for sure, 100%. Yeah, yeah I mean, yeah, that's how I would be. I would be super pissed and be ready to go and rock. Right. And, 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 I, I, I wouldn't and be very happy. I saying that. Another one was saying that. But, man, we're going to... We'll take you to the replay here in just a second, and that way you'll be able to see what went down. You know, I, I've been in some fights where if the ref didn't give me the benefit of the doubt, I wouldn't want him. So. Yeah, I yeah, know, of course, yeah, yeah. <laughs> as a fighter. You know, listen, a list draft guy, it, it just seems like bigger, stronger, dangerous guy right now, and that's no discredit to Jeremy Smith. A list draft's just a specimen. The guy's an absolute monster. Yeah. And those punches were landing. Not to mention, time. Inkram, that, I mean, he had his number tonight. Uh, he was just tagging him at will. Basically, you know, so it's just getting worse and worse. Well, we're going to take a look at that replay in a minute. We'll go to Carlos Kramer for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, another explosive fight. Give it up for these two warriors. This bout comes to an end at two minutes and one second of the very first round. Referee Scott Manhart stops about a TKO due to strikes for your winner, Ikram Alice Carroll. There's the sportsmanship. Ikram Aliskrav continues to roll. Nice win for him, highlight reel. It appeared the Smith may be getting up. It looks like he was gonna recover, but that being said, Aliskrav gets the win.